choices? What, what choices did I have? I didn't have anybody helping me with my homework like you did, Mikey. My poor mother was too busy killing herself at that box factory. And yeah, I did drop out of school. Was that a choice, though? One time, I got my car taken. Why did I lose my car? Because I missed a payment. Why did I miss a payment? Because I had to pay for the dentist instead. Why did I have to pay for the dentist? No, 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 no. I've gone over this a hundred times in my head, Mikey, and I think you should hear it too. Why did I have to pay for the dentist? Because I didn't have insurance. I cracked a tooth and ignored it for six months until an abscess formed. Why did I crack a tooth? Because one night, I thought I'd save a little money and skip dinner. But I got hungry. Decided to snack on a piece of candy brittle instead. And I was out of a job again. And that's how it always goes. If it's not the candy brittle, then it's Joyce's medication or my phone getting shut off or Russell Gillis breaking in and stealing my friggin' microwave. And you want to talk about choices. While you sit up here practically breaking your arm, patting yourself on the back for all you accomplished. Lucky you. You made some wise choices. But you're wrong if you think everyone has them. In fact, the only real choice I ever did make was dumping you. Not like I haven't thought about it a million times since. What would have happened if I hadn't dumped Mikey Dillon? Maybe I wouldn't have been with Kobe. Maybe I wouldn't have dropped out of school. Or maybe this could have been my place. So don't tell me you didn't have any help getting out of Southie. You had help. Not just your dad. If I hadn't let you go, you'd still be there right now. You'd be working down the variety store with Johnny Duggar. I let you go.